Hi guys! I'm Chris. And I'm Philippa. And this is a how-to video on how you can create your own professional self-tapes. This is when you film yourself singing, acting and dancing. Whether you send it in for an audition or an assessment, it's a really important skill that every performer should have. And we're going to show you how to do it, step by step. If you're filming a monologue, you can use your phone. Make sure the camera is landscape and not portrait. Frame it so you catch from your waist or torso up, a medium shot. Leave a little gap above your head, not too big. First prize is to get someone to hold your phone as steady as possible. If no one is available, try and stand your phone face level a meter away from you, balancing straight up so you're not filming at an angle. Lighting is important. Make sure we can clearly see you and your face. Best bet is to face a window for natural light. Have no bright lights behind you so that you don't become a silhouette. Try to avoid having a light directly above you to avoid shadows on your face. Make sure lighting is in front of you, even if above. Keep yourself completely in the light so that no part of you is in a shadow and not visible on camera. Make sure audio is clear and that you are audible at your softest. So film a test run, watch it back and make sure you can hear yourself. Keep your background as plain as possible. Try and use a blank wall or you can hang up a blanket or sheet. Try and keep it to a neutral or complementary color. If this is for an audition tape, give your ID. This is where you give your name, surname, agent, height, and sometimes the role that you're auditioning for, looking into the camera. Leave as little dead space as possible at the beginning and end of your video. If you have an iPhone, you can trim the video from your phone editor in your gallery. If you are singing in your self-tape, Use your downloaded song. Play the song from a speaker in the background. This is another device, either a speaker, phone, or laptop with decent sound. Make sure the music isn't louder than your voice. You should still be audible in the softest vocal part of the song. Again, run a test video to make sure everything is in order. All the tips on how you film your monologue count for singing. This is in terms of lighting, background, and the type of angle or shot you use. It's all the same. If you're filming a dance video, use the same tips. Make sure you can see your whole body and that you never go out of shot. If you need to record audio and not film it with music in the background, play the song using another device or a speaker. Sing into your phone using the voice memo app or similar app to record. Make sure the music isn't louder than your voice. You should still be audible in the softest vocal part of the song. If you are recording audio without music playing in the background, play the song using another device through headphones or earphones. Sing into your phone using the voice memo app or similar app to record. This will then just be your voice. This vocal recording can then be sent in to be added and edited into various other projects, such as a virtual choir. <laughs> This video will help you to create some great self-tapes. Anyone can do it, so go try it yourself.